Solidarity towards those fleeing the war is very important at the level of the European Union. We also need coordination among us in order to prevent human trafficking of vulnerable persons. The relocation of those who need protection is an essential part of the EU's temporary protection. Finland is ready to assume its responsibility in this common effort. There is no time to waste. We work with the Ukrainian authorities to transfer targeted groups of extremely vulnerable people to Finland. These groups include disabled persons and unaccompanied minors. Estonia has received one of the highest numbers of refugees per capita. We are now setting up an arrangement for refugees to transit from Estonia to Finland as easily as possible. Specific help to the vulnerable groups will be provided. Those fleeing the war need a vision for their future. We pay special attention to the integration of the refugees. We provide Ukrainian children easy and quick access to schools and education. Like this, we help them integrate our society. These children get skills that they will need in Ukraine in the future when they will be rebuilding Ukraine. This week we made a national budget decision to further allocate 700 million euros for helping Ukrainian refugees in Finland. As regards humanitarian and development aid, we have granted 40 million euro of additional support to the Ukraine and 1 million euro of humanitarian aid to Moldova. Finland supports Ukraine by giving military equipment, weapons and protective gear. Our common effort as the European Union is impressive and we must continue. The question is not if Ukraine will win, but when Ukraine will win the war. In our hearts, Ukrainians have already won. Our entire society is with the Ukrainian people. We do our best to help Ukraine and those fleeing from the atrocities of the war.